Hey guys, it's Japanese fan again. I am doing another tutorial, but this time it's on how to download um, Mika Mika Effect, how to use it, and how to put it on Mika Mika Day. So, here comes the tutorial. Sorry, I was watching the video I just made. And I was on Divine Art too. Okay, so go to Google and then type in Miku. Ah, <laughs> Miku Miku Effect Download. I already have it stored. Click the first link you have and it should take you to Miku Miku B. Now you see where do I download it? Right here. Whoops. Go to the second paragraph. Right, yeah, the <laughs> second paragraph. And then right here should be the link to the newest Miku Miku Effect. Click it. It should take you to a page like this. See? And then go down a little. And then there should be a little link right here. Click the link. Alright. Now, guys, I know a lot of you are like, always like, oh, I can't read Japanese, so I can't download it. If you get Google Chrome, it'll translate it for you. Alright, click download the file. Click this, click here to download, and click this, and it should begin download. Click it. Alright, so you see how it came on when, when we're on right here? Alright, now open where you keep Mika Mika Dance. Okay, I keep it right here. Go to WinRAR, and then it should have a Mika Mika full. Mika Mika edit. Um. Miku Miku Effect Folder. Alright. Click it. And it should give you these. Copy them or drag them over to the Miku Miku Dance folder. And let it go. And it should put all of like, the effect stuff on. I already have, so I'm not going to do it again. Alright. Then go to Miku Miku Dance. And this little tab should appear. Click Enable Effect and Auto Reload, and then your effects will be all enabled and stuff. Now, I know a lot of people have questions about, you know, FX folders because of the fact that you're like, oh, you can't drag them over. I don't know what to do. So, um, go to wherever you keep all your MMD stuff. Now, get a model that you want. In this case, I'm going to use Tatsuki. Um, she is a model you have to buy or something. You have to trade it for it. I'm willing to trade. Um, she's part of Kitty Air. I have all their models, and I'm still willing to trade. Alright. Yes, her tie is a little spammy, but once I download the motion data, she will, she'll be fine. Alright, so go back to that tab, MMV Effect. Click Effect Mapping. Click on the model, and click Set Effect. And then go to wherever you keep all your effects. Alright. Alright, see? Alright, in this case, I'm going to use Adult Shader. It is an FX file. Now you see how Map Effect file um, clicked. When you click the um, Set Effect, it opened this tab. Click an FX file. Alright, see how it got applied to her? Click Apply and OK. And it should stay on. And then, if you want me to prove it to you, I will download the motion data. Hold on. In this case, I'm just going to do Dancing Samurai. Alright, see? Now, for X files, you can just take them and drag them like a PMD file or a PMX file. So just go to your effects. In this case, I'm going to use Fireworks. Oh god, which one is it? I just downloaded this, um, this, uh, effect, so I'm like, how do I use it? I'm not sure who uses this. I will learn, people. I will learn. Alright. Then I'm just going to use a tome. Click the X file and drag it over. And, see? It loaded the effect and it should still work
Alright, so that was my effect tutorial. Um, watch out for more tutorials. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.